So if you didn't already know, Kyle Van Noy was released by the Dolphins um, on Wednesday, yesterday. Kyle Van Noy, um, the the signed Dolphin, he signed with the Miami Dolphins in twenty last offseason after being with the Patriots and the Lions in his career as a two-time Super Bowl champion. And many are wondering how, why he was released. And um, yes, yeah, so we're going to be going over this release. And he was released by... The Dolphins, after having a six sack, two, two forced fumble season, and um, forty six tackles. Um, but what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be going over the Kyle Van Noy release. Kyle Van Noy was cut by the Miami Dolphins, and it doesn't make a ton of sense because Kyle Van Noy is a you know, above average edge rusher, as he signed a pretty long term deal with the. The Miami Dolphins, of course. I mean, he's getting a three million dollar contract, as you see right here. I mean, I believe it's worth three years or four years. Um, but they just had to know where they released him. Um, and this could be a sign. I, mean, I know Kyle Van Noy is not making a ton, but Kyle, this could be a sign that the the Miami Dolphins want to put a push in for Deshaun Watson because of releasing players but i th i would think they would release maybe a guy like um kiko alonzo or eric rowe or someone like that instead of a just sign kyle van noy and you look it down at kyle van noy's stats he's had a lot of talent um at having two si he had a six sack season with new england last year three and a half and five and a half and then six with the uh, Miami Dolphins says he's going to – I think he'll be a lot like Earl Thomas where he sits on the market probably until the season starts maybe. Um, but Kyle Van Noy I think was very good. I don't think it, it makes sense to be releasing him. One thing if he's having maybe he missed the whole season or he only had like two sacks. But Kyle Van Noy was probably the most productive pass rusher on that team. <laughs> Um, maybe Raekwon, maybe Raekwon Davis, uh, sorry for all these ads. Um, but it doesn't make a ton of sense because of, other than Xavier and Howard, there was no elite defensive player on that team and they just signed him to a contract. Maybe you'd make a little bit more sense if his contract was expiring and if he was making a little bit more, but with Kyle Van Noy, out um it definitely we're going to be seeing a much uh much bigger free agency he could be going to a team possibly a team that needs an edge rusher um teams that come to mind maybe he goes back to new england maybe he he needs he goes to new england the giants are there um giants maybe like maybe the saints um, maybe the Chiefs. Chiefs could use an edge rusher. Um, any team like that really could work. I could see the Cowboys getting him. Um, but Kyle Van Noy, definitely he can play. It. I don't think he's that good. He, I don't think you can play him at middle linebacker. I think he'd be a good. I think he's an edge rusher. He can can sort of play right end. Um, but as a Patriots fan, he was. I was kind of sad he left. Um, the Patriots, but. He's had he just had six sacks and two forced fumbles, so I don't think it makes a ton of sense that he was released. Um, possibly, I think my top five teams that will get him are definitely probably like the maybe the Seahawks, Cowboys, Chiefs, maybe the Jaguars. He stays in Florida. He goes to the Jaguars. Um, Giants maybe, and then of course he could return to New England. Um, but I don't think he will. Tell me in the comments down below what you think of this. Uh, what, what do you think of this this news? Kyle Van Noy um, just signed a contract with the Miami Dolphins, getting cut by the Dolphins, and he is now a free agent. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of these free agency videos just on my computer with the face cam. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, and I have this set up tight ends. So stay tuned for that. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.